Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, this channel is about everything that inspires me. Travel, shopping, beauty, classy style and so much more. Today is a beautiful sunny summer day here in Warsaw and I want to speak about sneakers. I want to speak about trainers or however you call them. These comfortable shoes that you wear in your everyday life that you wear to run errands and you just basically can wear these kind of shoes everywhere. As I was getting ready for our trip to Canada which is going to happen so so soon, this video will probably be the last one or the one before the last one that I'm going to publish before I start publishing our Canadian trip and I cannot believe this I, you know we were getting ready for this trip for half a year we were planning everything and now it's all finally happening and I couldn't be happier I love you know I feel like I'm going to love uh, the, the trip a lot but I loved this whole process so much I, I feel like it's equally as great as the trip itself and as I was getting ready and thinking about everything that I need to pack I understood that I don't actually have a pair of shoes that is going to be very very comfortable but at the same time is going to look appropriate for all of the outfits that I plan to wear because you know sports shoes really like New Balance uh, sneakers or APL sneakers they are super comfortable but I'm not going to wear them with a dress, I'm not going to wear them with a skirt, I am even not always want to wear them with a pair of shorts if this is a classy elegant outfit, I'm not going to wear New Balance or APL sneakers. I want to wear something else, something probably made of leather and I wanted uh, this to be probably white or have a neutral color for it to be able to look nice with the majority of my outfits. And as I was thinking about this pair of shoes that I imagined in my head that I need, I came up with an idea of purchasing a pair of Veja sneakers. I hope I'm pronouncing the name of the brand right. I think it's Ve it's, uh, it's either Veja or Veja. I'm going to say something in between, Veja, Veja, and they looked really cool to me. I, I've never tried those sneakers before I got them. I just seen them multiple times on people on the streets, like on really cool and stylish people. I've seen them on celebrities and I've heard about these sneakers, good things when it comes to how comfortable they are because you know there are so many cool sneakers from luxury brands like white sneakers from Jimmy Choo are really really cool I think they are maybe the best white sneakers from luxury brands Louis Vuitton sneakers amazing I love my white Louis Vuitton sneakers but they are not as comfortable as like Veja sneakers which we will get to in a, in a little while and that was the reason why I went and looked for Veja sneakers here in Warsaw. I found them in the shop of uh, Other Stories brand. If you don't know what is Other Stories, Other Stories is a brand which is owned by H&M Group and there they have really nice clothing, jewelry, accessories but also they sell shoes there and not only their own shoes which they produce but also they sell their brands like New Balance, I think there is Adidas there and there are Veja sneakers there as well and that was the place where I found my Veja sneakers. I tried them on, they had my size and I was happy to get them. So I think I'm going to take another sip of my coffee and I will get the box of sneakers here because it's really strange to talk about sneakers and not having them in my hand. So let's have another sip. I invite you to get yourself a nice refreshing or heartwarming drink as well and we will jump straight into reviewing Veja sneakers. Alright, here is my Veja box. Uh, the box doesn't look any 
kind of luxurious at all. It's just a regular shoe box. But before I open it, I wanted to say a few words about the brand, so the brand Veja. And uh, you probably know nothing about this brand, just like I did before I got my pair of sneakers. And so Veja is a French brand of sneakers. Uh, the Most of the sneakers, or maybe even all of their sneakers, are produced in Brazil right now. And uh, this brand is famous because it is the first ever sustainable sneaker brand in the world. I think after uh, they started being this first brand, other brands appeared, but they were the first brand. And all of their sneakers are made using organic raw materials like organic cotton, sustainably sourced leather, etc. etc. So if this is something that you like and that you are interested in, Veja brand is going to be for you. So let's open the box. Inside of the box, you just have the sneakers, nothing, nothing else. Ah, it's written in here, since 2005, Veja has been creating sneakers in a different way, mixing social projects, economic justice, and ecological materials, which sounds really, really nice. And, well, you don't have any, like, dust bags, nothing like this. You just have the sneakers inside. And let's get them out. And hello there. Here are my Veja sneakers. These sneakers are, I think, two months old right now. And I think I can already speak a little bit about how comfortable they are, what I love or maybe don't love about them. And... Well, just make a review about them, but I'm sure I will be able to tell you more about how comfortable these sneakers are after our Canadian trip because I'm going to wear them non-stop out there and wear them the whole day, like have really lots of walking in these sneakers. So we'll see uh, after the trip. So for now, let's start. Uh, first things first, the price. The price of these sneakers in other stories uh, here in Warsaw was about 150 euro. This is the price that you will find everywhere in the world for these sneakers, I think. The name of the sneakers that I got for myself is Veja Campo Leather Sneakers. I got them for myself in a color white and beige. Uh, this rubber sole, I believe, is the same color for all of the sneakers Veja does. Uh, here I have real leather, but I, th I think, like, I'm almost sure that Veja uh, does sneakers made of vegan leather as well. Maybe not exactly this, mo this model, but you can find uh, vegan leather sneakers uh, from a Veja brand. Uh, also, the size that I got for myself is a size 40 and I would say that uh, these sneakers, in my opinion, uh, they um, run a little bit smaller. They are not true to size. And uh, sometimes, you know, sometimes I get from brands 39 or 39 and a half and here I had to get 40. And I feel like uh, they, for me, they reminded me of Zara shoe sizing. So if you know exactly what your Zara size is, uh, it probably will be the same in Veja sneakers. But, you know, you can always... Um, order something online and then if the size is wrong you can return and get another size. So let's speak about the quality. What can we say about it after two months of wearing these sneakers? Nothing bad, nothing bad at all. I don't see any any damage that I've done. Just they are a little bit dusty here. It, I think I will have to uh, wash, wash the laces before our trip but generally I don't see any scratches at all. Uh, you can just uh, see that they will start wearing off in here, just probably like most of the sneakers do, but at the front nothing really changed, they, they look like new. Let's get into the topic of how comfortable these sneakers are and I would rate them as 8 out of 10, which is quite high. For example, I would rate my Louis Vuitton sneakers at 2 out of 10. If we change uh, and put the new balance thing that inside of Louis Vuitton sneakers, they get to like 4, 5 out of 10. And this is a solid 8 out of 10. The 10 out of 10 will be APL sneakers or New Balance sneakers. And this is 8 out of 10, which I think is very good for something that looks like this. This doesn't look like 
something that you wear to, 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 do, to do sports. This looks like something you can wear everywhere and that is what I wanted. When I went to buy these sneakers, I wore a skirt. I wore it on purpose because I wanted to see how they're going to look with a skirt. I didn't want something bulky. I'm not that kind of girl. I don't like bulky sneakers when I wear a skirt or a dress. And if you watched my channel for some time, you probably know that I'm really into classy style and timeless pieces generally. Sometimes I like to have fun with colors or like buy something fun for summer but when it comes to shoes when it comes to accessories i love classy and timeless things and this is a classy and timeless thing of course i don't plan to wear this pair of sneakers forever but i love the fact that it's going to look classy and i'm going to be kind of elegant wearing this sneaker so I'm going to wear it with jeans, I'm going to wear it with uh, wide legged pants like linen pants or cotton pants that I have. Also I can wear it with midi skirts and with mini skirts with all with dresses which are not too like dressy and evening dresses with more of a casual dress. Uh, with casual skirts, with shorts, it's going to look really cool with so many outfits. I am going, I think you're going to see all of my outfits wearing these sneakers in Canada. And in conclusion, I want to say that in my opinion, Vecha sneakers are totally worth the money that you're paying for them. You will get a high quality, beautiful, classy product. And of course, lots of people are wearing Vegas, but not as many people as are wearing Adidas sneakers or New Balance sneakers. This is something more premium, in my opinion. That's how I feel about them. They are more premium. They are not like for everybody, not for mass market, as you understand. And maybe, you know, one day something gets trendy and everybody starts wearing this and then you don't feel as special about them. But at this moment in time, not everybody, everybody is wearing Vegas sneakers. Right now, the majority of people are wearing Adidas and New Balance and you're going to be more special if you wear something like this. You're going to be a little bit different, but you're going to still be like stylish, classy. You're going to look cool in this, I promise you. And that was it that I wanted to say today. I hope that you liked this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. I will see you very soon next Friday. Bye.